To pick the right programming language for the cloud, you need to know two things. One, what type of app you're building, and two, what part of the cloud computing stack you plan to target. For example, if you simply plan to consume cloud-based services through a web browser, JavaScript is the only language you'll need to know. With JavaScript, you can interact with object storage, you can invoke RESTful web services, and you can authenticate users with products like MongoDB Realm. JavaScript is the language of the web browser, but for server-side programming, I'm a big fan of Java. Java has been around for 30 years. It has incredible community support, and it has connectors for practically any backend resource you'd ever need to connect to. For the creation of cloud-native microservices, Java is my number one choice. And for Microsoft developers, any language that works well on the .NET frameworks is an excellent cloud-native choice as well. Java is like the Swiss army knife of programming languages. It can do just about anything well, but when it comes to data science or artificial intelligence, choose Python. You'll be better served by Python if you're doing machine learning or using AI. Now, what if you actually want to configure the systems that power the cloud? In that case, you'll be working with Linux, and Linux is written in C. If you want to develop code that lives in the lowest layers of the cloud computing stack, C is the language that you need to know. And of course, most cloud-native applications are deployed to Docker and Kubernetes, and those are written in Go. If you want to extend Docker or customize your Kubernetes runtime, Go is what you need. So those are what I consider to be the most important cloud computing languages, JavaScript, Python, Java, .NET, C, and Go.